girls and homeboys. It's Sasha here. Welcome back to Carefree Curls. And I wanted to go ahead and have this moment caught on camera. Um, before I start, before I jump in, make sure you thumbs up this video. Make sure you hit subscribe. And um, make sure you leave a comment down below later on. I love to interact with you all. So just jumping into it, I really wanted to wash my hair. It's been a little bit over two weeks since the last time I got my hair washed. Um, when I went to the stylist and she did not shampoo it. She did a rosemary treatment on my scalp. So it wasn't really like I got my hair shampooed. So I've really been wanting to get my hair washed and get my scalp just letting it breathe and air it out. So I went ahead and washed my hair in the shower. I did do the stocking cap method as you can see because it's still on my head <laughs> and I have not looked at my hair. So I have no clue how it looks and I wanted to reveal it with you all. So. I'm going to tell you just a little bit what I did because I want to make this video quick. So I just took my little applicator bottle. I filled it up to about, um, has it on the side, but I filled it up to about here with water. And then from here up, I put in shampoo and filled up the um, bottle. So I wet my hair first so the shampoo could move easily through my hair. Then I took the applicator bottle, squirted it in a few places, rubbed it in. Um, tried not to do it too rough because I did not want my comb coils or my baby twists or my baby locks or whatever to unravel so scrub my scalp it fit, felt so good then, then I rinsed my hair maybe two times under the water just letting it run you know still you know moving my fingers along my head and really trying to work out the shampoo and that was really it y'all just and I did use warm water the whole time I just wanted my scalp clean so now I'm gonna go ahead and take off this cap and go ahead and moisturize my re-moisturize my hair again <laughs> how this is gonna come out and I am gonna let my hair air dry so I'm gonna give it a good shake Okay, what we working with, what we working with. It doesn't look that different. Of course, it's poofy. It's super poofy at the root. Okay, but hey, my hair needed to be washed. I have been working out every other day, and I just could not anymore. So, yeah. I mean, okay, it's not terrible. I'm not crazy. Like, my hair didn't really unravel, which is good. Yes, it's frizzy. But I'm cool with that, as long as my scalp is clean. Okay, look at that. Okay, girl. But I am still going to wash my... Now, I was planning to retwist my hair next, this upcoming weekend, which is about five days from now, five, six days from now, which I still might wash and retwist it because I'm still going to be working out this week, and so my scalp is still going to be dirty. <laughs> so, um, but I do like that I can tell my hair, you know, took the shampoo pretty well. Um, like this one's hanging on there but it's not completely unraveled which is good so yeah I'm probably I may wait longer to retwist my hair just depending on how my hair looks um, after it's fully dried and in a few days but I can always if it gets to be too much I can always throw on a head a thick um, one of those wide head headbands or um, you know throw on a turban or something so we'll see how that goes but that's it y'all that's all i have planned to do for this video was just to show you how your hair may turn out if um you do decide to do the stocking cap method because i really didn't find um a lot of info out there on it but i wanted to go ahead and do it because of course my scalp was itching so <laughs> that's how it turned out for me and i will probably update you all I am about five and a half weeks locked, so my comb coils, I, you know, they didn't unravel, which is great. But if you have only been locked for less than that, maybe a couple weeks, I mean, you can still try to do the stocking cap method. Just be really gentle and make sure you dilute your shampoo so it doesn't get stuck in your hair and that it's easier to wash out. So, yeah, yeah, y'all, this is Sister Girls and Homeboys. Um, and that is with the Z, sister girls, homeboys, okay? <laughs> Thank you so much for watching, y'all. Like I said, make sure you thumbs up this video. Make sure that you leave a comment down below. I want to know, have you ever done the stocking cap method with your locks? And if you have, was it a good experience for you? Or did you have some results that you were not happy with? Um, let me know down below. Make sure y'all follow me on Instagram at Carefree Curls. And I will see you in the next one when I call you back. Bye!